There's a Dragon in Your Book, written by Tom Fletcher, illustrated by Greg Abbott. Oh look, there's an egg in your book. It looks ready to hatch. Whatever you do, don't turn the page. I can't believe you just did that. The egg has hatched and now there's a dragon in your book. Don't be scared, it's a baby dragon. Why don't you tickle her little nose? Ah, choo! Oops. The dragon accidentally sneezed a fire in your book. You need to put it out quickly. Help dragon blow out the flame and turn the page. Oh no. Your dragon didn't blow the fire out. She blew more fire. Carefully cover the flames by turning the page. That should put them out. That's not good. The fire is getting bigger. Don't get too close. If only we could think of a way to put out this fire. That's it. Let's use your imagination to put the fire out. Imagine a great big water balloon right in the middle of the next page. Make sure it's full and ready to pop. Perfect. Now use your finger to pop the balloon and get ready for the splash. Hooray, you put the fire out. Give the dragon a high five. You have a great imagination and dragon must be a little hungry now. Why don't you use your imagination again and think up a yummy treat for her? How about a great big cone filled with a triple scoop of scrummy, yummy, ice cold, chocolate and strawberry flavoured ice cream with sprinkles. Wow, that looks delicious. Yum. Well, Dragon must be tired after all of that adventure. I think it's time for her to fly away from home. She looks very full. She's going to need some help taking off. Flap the book up and down like giant dragon wings. Nearly there. Keep flapping. There she goes. Goodbye, dragon. Wave goodbye and turn the pit. Hang on a second. What's this? Oh, look. More eggs. Whatever you do, don't turn the page. Uh-oh. I think it's time to close the book carefully.